Well, hey there, entrepreneurs. Welcome to 30 Days of the Canon M50. If you haven't already downloaded the free PDF guide on the first video, that's just about a minute long, make sure you go back to the beginning of the series, get that free PDF on the best settings for video for the Canon M50, but otherwise, let's jump into today's video. So the Canon Connect app that, you know, whether you're using Android or iOS devices, it's just like one of the best things that could have been implemented uh, when it comes to the Canon M50. There are a few limitations that I don't prefer that they kind of did or added in there, which is you can't watch your 4K videos on your phone while you're connected to the app. You actually have to download it and then watch it on your phone that way. A minor inconvenience, but just something else to add to the wish list that I wish they would change for future, you know, iterations of the M50 and just any camera in general that they make. One of the things that I really like is that, you know, if I'm out and about, if I'm shooting, doing videos and all kinds of stuff, is that I can actually upload any pictures from events or just fun stuff that I'm doing, um, testing maybe in the office or whatever, and upload that directly to Instagram. And so uh, that's what we're gonna be talking about in today. So one of the prerequisites before we actually get started is that if you don't know already how to connect to the app, then you wanna check out the previous video that I did and I'll link that up above, but you wanna make sure that you are already connected to the app and once you're in then we'll jump over to the next part right now okay so once you're actually in the app if you want to go and take a picture then that's something that you can do and then you'll be able to review it in here but otherwise you want to make sure that you're on the home page of the app and click on images on the camera then from there you want to go and select the image that you want in the down facing error you want to pick now you can pick reduced or original it's up to you and then from there don't actually go to where it says open app you know you just want to go into instagram on your own and just kind of minimize and put the canon app in the background and then once you want to go from instagram once you're in there you just go and you upload like normally click the plus button and then go to that resize it however you want to click on next you can still add any of your filters and all of that and the canon m50 app is still running in the background so even though you're doing all of this stuff you can still go back to the actual app continue recording continue doing whatever you know if you so if you wanted to do a quick clip recording from the camera or whatever upload that to and upload that to instagram and then keep going then you can do that uh, as well so that's the very very simple way if you're taking pictures you want to connect it to your app that you can do it and then you all, they also have one where as you're taking pictures you can download those to your phone so that they're already there and upload that a little bit of a different method but essentially the same stuff but this one is just like you got a picture that you want to share a few pictures you can download them send them directly to instagram and you're off to the races